Understanding the phrase, get expelled. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a common but important phrase in English, get expelled. Understanding this phrase is crucial, especially in educational and professional contexts. So, let's dive in and unravel its meaning and usage. Get expelled refers to the act of being officially removed from an institution, like a school or university, due to violating rules or unacceptable behavior. This phrase carries a serious tone and is often associated with disciplinary actions. For instance, in a sentence, John got expelled from school for cheating on his exams. Here, got expelled indicates that John was formally removed from his school due to his misconduct. Expulsion is usually a last resort and follows a series of warnings or previous disciplinary actions. The context can vary, from academic dishonesty to violence. The consequences of getting expelled are significant. It can affect a person's educational trajectory and sometimes even their professional future. For example, after getting expelled, Sarah found it difficult to enroll in another school. This sentence highlights the long-term impact of expulsion. Understanding how to appropriately use get expelled in conversations is key. It's typically used in formal and serious discussions, and less so in casual conversations. It's important to use this phrase with an understanding of its gravity and implications. Here's an example. In a parent-teacher meeting, a teacher might say, if he continues to break the rules, he may get expelled. This conveys a serious warning about the student's behavior. The concept and consequences of expulsion can vary between cultures and educational systems. Being culturally sensitive when discussing or referring to expulsion is important, especially in an international or multicultural setting. And that's a wrap on, get expelled. We hope this video has been enlightening and helps you understand and use this phrase accurately in English. Remember, language learning is a journey, and every new phrase you learn opens up new avenues of communication. See you in the next video.